a few years ago, we did that story about how McDonald's uses this pink slime to make its uh, hamburger meat and its chicken nuggets, right? And basically what it is, it is basically meat that has been ground up very finely. And then they use something known as um, ammonium hydroxide in order to kill all the bacteria in the meat. Now this is not like great cuts of meat, right? It's basically like the odds and ends of the animal that are left over. And like I said, really? yeah, obviously. <laughs> um, and then they have to use this ammonium hydroxide because of the fact that it has a ton of bacteria in it. And they use this nasty slush to make all of their products, right? Mm -hmm. So um, there's this chef by the name of Jamie Oliver who decided to really give McDonald's a hard time about this. And as a result, McDonald's USA has just announced that they will stop using ammonium hydroxide in their beef. Wow, you gotta give Jamie Oliver a lot of credit. At first I was thinking that maybe he was doing it to get some attention mm -hmm. and like, ah, is that kind of a cheesy PR move and stuff? But look, you got the job done. On the other hand, now your meat will have bacteria in it. No, well. <laughs> no, I hope they found another way. I hope they found another way as well. Who knows what that way is. But what I found really fascinating about this story, and everyone already knows this, right? You go to Canada or you go to a different country, and they have standards there. They have regulations put in place so fast food companies can't use a cleaning product in order to sanitize the beef. Mm -hmm. Right. So what, what's amazing to me is that uh, a spokesperson from McDonald's in Canada released a statement saying, oh, we've never used this disgusting product in our meat. Like we've always only used 100 percent beef, salt, pepper, and that's it. You know, and I remember having a burger when I was in Europe once and thinking and it was a McDonald's burger and thinking, wow, this tastes really good. McDonald's is awesome. <laughs> and it turns out that, yeah, if it's not the same thing, it's so different. In the U.S., we have no standards. We'll eat anything. Well, when I was in Taiwan, uh, all the restaurants had signs on them saying, uh, don't worry, no U.S. beef allowed. Okay? Because our reputation abroad is those guys do anything for a buck. So God knows what's in their beef. The goo that they use, it's pink. And the reason it's pink is because they shave some of it off of the bones and the blood mixes in. Yeah. That's why they got to use that bacteria killing chemicals to get all the blood, et cetera, out of the goo. Mm -hmm. That's why you, uh, you have 99 cent value menus, because if you're gonna produce it for that cheap, you gotta find a way to do it. So it's not like they can't do it with the bacteria killing things. It just will cost you a little more, right? Right. Wow, let's go to $1.09, I think it's gonna be okay.